So the heavy rain here looks like it could be starting to move out, at least for the time being. But a lot of that rain flooding our roadways throughout the morning. That's right. And our Katrina Weber, she is live on the city's north side where the water still has some streets closed, Katrina. So we understand you're on Dreamland near Lock Hill Silma, and it looks like some of the fast moving water is there. What is it looking like? Yeah, it almost looks like water land out here. Take a look at this road and just how much water is flowing here. We're sort of downhill, so of course things flow downhill, and that's definitely the case here. Now, in the middle of this water, which seems to have receded somewhat from what it was earlier, you can see there's a car here, or actually there, now you can see there's a car here. Uh, it looks like someone may not have gotten the memo about this road being flooded out and tried to cross and got stuck, and that's exactly what every authority uh, tells you not to do. They say, turn around, don't drown. Uh, someone apparently tried to cross and got stuck. Now, we haven't heard anything about injuries, but this has been uh, a call that firefighters have received several times overnight. We understand at one point they had about seven of these kinds of things going on. Uh, so, of course, if you do see a road that's still flooded, you see the barricades still in place, you may not want to go around them because you could end up in a situation like this. But again, uh, no worries on any injuries related to this incident or any of the many that they had overnight. Reporting live on the north side, Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News. Hello, everybody. Stefania Jimenez here. Thank you so much for watching KSAT's YouTube channel. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.